Hey, hey, we're saints. Good evening. God bless and keep you. Thank you. Those who are with us, those who are watching at home, please pray for us as we do for you. Blessed is our God always, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship and fall down before God our King. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King and our God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ himself, our King and our God. Bless the Lord, O my soul, O Lord, my God, thou hast been magnified exceedingly. Confession and majesty hast thou put on, who covers thyself with light as with garment, who stretches out the heaven as it were a curtain, who supported the chambers and the waters, who appointed the clouds for his ascent, who walketh upon the wings of the winds, who maketh his angels spirits and his ministers a flame of fire, who establisheth the earth and the sureness thereof, it shall not be turned back forever and ever. The abyss like a garment is his mantle, upon the mountains shall the waters stand. If thy rebuke they will flee, if the voice of thy thunder shall they be afraid. The mountains rise up and the plains sink down unto the place where thou hast established them. Thou appointest the bound that they shall not pass, neither return to cover the earth. He sendeth forth springs in the valleys between the mountains where the waters run. They shall give drink to all the beasts of the field. The wild asses will wait to quench their thirst. Beside them will the birds of the heaven lodge. In the midst of the rocks will they give voice. He watereth the mountains from his chamber. The earth shall be satisfied with the fruit of thy works. He causes the grass to grow for the cattle and green herb for the service of men. To bring forth bread out of the earth and wine maketh glad the heart of man. To make his faith cheerful with oil and bread strengtheneth man's heart. The trees of the plain shall be satisfied, the cedars of Lebanon which thou hast planted. There all the sparrows make their nest, the house of the heron is chief among them. The high mountains are a refuge for the hearts, and so is the rock for the hares. He hath made his mood for seasons. The sun knoweth is going down, thou pointest the darkness, and there was the night wherein all the beasts of the forest will go abroad. The young lions roaring after their prey and seeking their food from God. The sun ariseth, they are gathered together, they lay them down in their dens. Man shall go forth into his work, into his labor, until the evening. How magnified are thy works, O Lord, and wisdom hast thou made them all. The earth is filled with thy creation, so is this great and spacious sea, when are things creeping innumerable, small living creatures of the great. There go the ships that are this Leviathan, whom thou hast made to play therein. All things wait on thee to give them their food in due season. When thou givest it, them, they will gather it. When thou openest thy hand, that all things shall be filled with goodness. When thou turnest away thy face, they shall be troubled. <coughs> thou wilt take their spirit, and they shall cease, and unto the dust shall they return. Thou wilt send forth thy spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let the glory of the Lord be unto the ages. The Lord will rejoice in his works. Who looketh on the earth and maketh it tremble, who toucheth the mountains and they smoke. I will sing unto the Lord throughout my life. I will chant to my God for as long as I have my being. May my words be sweet unto him. I will rejoice in the Lord. Oh, that sinners would cease from the earth and they that work iniquity, that they should be no more. Bless the Lord of my soul. The sun knoweth is going down. Thou appointest the darkness and there was the night. How magnified are the works, O Lord, and wisdom hast thou made them all. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. O our God and our own glory to thee. In peace let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the peace from above and the salvation of our souls let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the peace of the whole world, for the good estate of the holy churches of God, and for the union of all men let us pray to the Lord. Lord for this holy house and for those who with faith, reverence, and fear of God enter therein let us pray to the Lord. Lord for our metropolitan and Father Joseph, for the venerable priesthood, the diaconate, and Christ all the clergy and the people. People, let us pray to the Lord. The Metropolitan Paul, Archbishop John, and for their quick and safe release from captivity, let us pray to the Lord. The President of the United States and all civil authorities, and for our armed forces everywhere, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this city and every city and land, and for the faithful who dwell therein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For healthful seasons, for abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have by sea, by land, and by air, for the sick, the suffering, captives, and their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for our deliverance from all tribulation, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Yeah, Help so. us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Yeah, Calling so. to remembrance our all holy, immaculate, most blessed, and glorious Lady Theotokos, and ever Virgin yeah, Mary, of all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all of our life unto Christ our God. To thee, o Lord. For unto thee are due all glory, honor, and worship, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages.
excuses and sins. With men that work iniquity, and I will not join with their chosen. The righteous man will chasten me with mercy and reprove me. As for the oil of the sinner, let it not anoint my head. More yet more is my prayer in the presence of their pleasures. Swallowed up nearby the rock have their judges been. They shall hear my words, for they be sweetened. As a clod of earth is broken upon the earth, so have their bones been scattered nigh unto Hades. For unto thee, O Lord, O Lord, are mine eyes in thee. Have I hope? Take not my soul away. Snare which they have laid for me, and from the stumbling blocks of them that work iniquity, the sinner shall fall into their own net. I am alone until I pass by. With my voice unto the Lord have I cried, with my voice unto the Lord have I made my supplication. I will pour out before him my supplication, mine affliction before him will I declare. When my spirit was fainting within me, then thou knewest my past. In this way wherein I have walked, they hid for me a snare. I looked upon my right hand and beheld, and there was none that did know me. Light has veiled me, and there is none that watcheth out for my soul. I have cried unto thee, O Lord, I said, Thou art my hope, my portion art thou in the land of the living. Attend unto my supplication. For I am brought very low. Deliver me from them that persecute me, for they are stronger than I. Bring my soul out of prison, that I may confess thy name. Come, let us rejoice in the Lord who crushed the dominion of death. And enlighten the race of man. Let us cry out with the bodiless host. O our Creator and Savior, glory be to Thee. The righteous shall wait patiently for me until Thou shalt reward me. 
the cross and burial hast thou endured for us, O Savior, and as God thou hast slain death by death, wherefore we worship thy resurrection on the third day. Lord, glory be to thee. Out of the depths have I cried unto thee, O Lord, O Lord, hear my voice. On seeing the arising of the Creator, the apostles marveled, crying out with angelic praise. This is the glory of the church. This is the wealth of the kingdom. O Thou who didst suffer for us, Lord, glory be to Thee. Let Thine ears be attentive to the voice of my supplication. Though Thou wast taken captive by lawless men, O Christ, yet Thou art my God, and I am not ashamed. Thou wast smitten on the back, I do not deny it. Thou wast nailed to the cross, and I conceal it not. In thine arising do I boast, for thy death is my life. O omnipotent and man-befriending Lord, glory be to thee. If thou shouldst mark iniquities, O Lord, O Lord, who shall stand? For with thee there is forgiveness. In fulfillment of David's prophecy, in Zion Christ unveiled his majesty to his disciples, revealing himself as the one who is praised and ever glorified with the Father and the Holy Spirit, once being without flesh as the Word, but now for us becoming incarnate, being put to death as man, and arising according to his power as the friend of man. For thy name's sake have I patiently waited for thee, O Lord. My soul hath waited patiently for thy word, my soul hath hoped in the Lord. Thou didst descend into Hades, O Christ, as thou didst will. Thou didst despoil death, since thou art God and Master. And thou didst rise on the third day, and from the bonds of Hades and corruption, didst thou also raise a Adam, who cried out and said, Glory to thy resurrection, O only friend of man. Mary. From the morning watch until night, from the morning watch, let Israel trust in the Lord. O godly-minded Father, Sabbath, peer of angel kind, Companion of the prophets, dweller with saints in the heights. Join air with the apostles and all the martyrs. Thou who now dwellest in the unwaning light, Lit with the divine rays of that most fiery brightness. Before, Before the highest of things desired, thou now dost stand with great boldness, all filled with light. And thus rejoice in his divine and sacred visions. And thou unceasingly delightest in his beauty. Do 
thou entreat Christ, do thou plead with Christ, O righteous one, that the church may be granted conquered tranquility and great mercy and lasting unity. For with the Lord there is mercy, and with him is abundant redemption, and he will deliver Israel from all his iniquities. O godly-minded Father, of us, peer of angels, kind compassion of the prophets, dweller with the saints in heights, join air with the apostles and all the martyrs. Thou who now dwells in the unwaning light, lit with the divine rays of that most fiery brightness. Before the highest of things desired, thou now dost stand with great boldness, all filled with light, and dost rejoice in his divine and sacred visions, and thou unceasingly delightest in his beauty, does thou entreat Christ, do thou bleed with Christ, O righteous one, that the church may be granted concord, tranquility, great mercy, and lasting unity. Praise the Lord, all ye nations. Praise him, all ye people. O blessed Sabbath, lamp of abstinence that not could quench Far shining luminary of monks and treasury of cures that beameth with the splendor of love most fiery. Tower of patience never shaken or moved, strength and firm foundation for them that show thee honor. O thou who madest the wilderness a great and populous city, and in all truth did show it for to be a paradise most godly. Which bringeth forth thee saved as fruits divine and comely. Do thou entreat Christ, do thou plead with Christ, O righteous one, that the church may be granted concord, tranquility, great mercy, and lasting unity. For his mercy is great toward us, and the truth of the Lord endures forever. O godly Sabbath, blazing pillar, bright with virtue's fire, 
and beacon light that showeth peoples the way leading through the sea of the wide world unto the divine port spirit of error as thou cast to the ground o thou purest vessel of god the holy spirit unto monastics thou art a guide and an exact rule and stand on of abstinence outstanding height of true humility and meekness and fountain gushing forth with seas of cures and healings do thou entreat Christ, do thou plead with Christ, O righteous one, that the church may be granted concord, tranquility, great mercy, and lasting unity. Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, preserving intact the image of God within thee, and establishing thy mind as ruler over the destructive passions through asceticism thou didst attain to the likeness of god as far as is possible for in bravely come Telling nature, thou was diligent to subject the worst to the better, and to subjugate the flesh to the spirit. Hence thou didst prove to be the summit of monastics, the colonizer of the wilderness, a trainer of them that run the course well, and a most exact rule of virtue. And now in the heavens, with the taking away of the looking glass, O Savas, thou clearly behold the holy trinity before whom thou standest face to face, making it Surpass. 
Almighty, the God of our fathers, we pray thee, hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Have mercy on us, O God, according to thy great goodness, we pray thee, hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for all pious and orthodox Christians. And we pray for our father and metropolitan Joseph. And we pray for our brethren, the priests, deacons, and monks, and all our brethren in Christ. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for the blessed and ever memorable founders of this holy temple and for all our fathers and brethren the orthodox departed this life before us who here in all the world lie asleep in the Lord again we pray for mercy life peace health salvation and visitation and pardon and remission of sins for the servants of God all Orthodox Christians of true worship who live and dwell in this community. And we pray for those who bear fruit and do good works in this holy and all venerable temple, those who serve and those who sing, and all the people here present who await thy great and rich mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. For thou art a merciful God who loves mankind, and unto thee do they ascribe glory, to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Vouchsafe, O Lord, to keep us this evening without sin. Blessed art thou, O Lord, the God of our fathers, and praised and glorified is thy name forever. Amen. Let thy mercy be upon us, O Lord, even as we have set our hope on thee. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, o Master, make me to understand thy statutes. Blessed art thou, Holy One, enlighten me with thy statutes. Thy mercy, O Lord, endures forever, but despise not the works of thy hands. To thee belong the worship, to thee belong the praise, to thee belong the glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to ages of ages. Amen. Let us complete our evening prayer unto the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. That the holy evening may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, o Lord. An angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, o Lord. and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask of the Lord. Grant all things good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord, and that we may complete the remaining Lord. time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord, and Christian ending to our life, Lord. painless, blameless, peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, let us ask of the Lord, and calling to remembrance Lord. our all holy, immaculate, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all of our life unto Christ our God. For thou art a good God who loves mankind, and unto thee do we ascribe glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Peace be with you all. And with thy spirit. Let us bow our heads unto the Lord. Blessed and glorified be the might of the kingdom of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Thou didst rise from the grave, O Savior of the world, and together with thy flesh, thou didst also raise up man. Lord, glory be to thee. The Lord is king, he is clothed with majesty. The Lord is clothed with strength, and he hath girt himself. Come, let us worship him who is risen from the dead and who hath enlightened all things. For he hath freed us from the tyranny of Hades by his arising on the third day, granting us life and great mercy. For he established the world which shall not be shaken. When thou didst descend to Hades below Christ, thou didst despoil death. And arising on the third day, thou didst also raise us to glorify thine omnipotent of 
arising, O Lord, thou friend of man. Holiness becometh thy house, O Lord, unto length of days. Thou didst appear awesome, O Lord, while lying in the grave as one that sleepeth. And arising on the third day as one mighty, thou didst also raise Adam, who cried out, Glory to thy resurrection, only friend of man. May I glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. We the multitudes of monastics honor thee, our teacher, O Sabbath. Our Father, for through Thee have we learned to walk the path that is truly straight. Blessed art Thou, O as Amen. Uh -huh.
thou thy servant depart in peace according to thy word. For mine eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared before the face of all people, a light to lighten the Gentiles from the glory of thy people Israel. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. All holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse us from our sins. Master of our dying pleas. Holy God, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. <laughs> Amen. Thou didst shatter death by thy cross. Thou didst open paradise to the thief. Thou didst turn the sadness of the ointment bearing women into joy. And didst bid thine apostles proclaim a warning that thou hast risen, O Christ, granting to the world thy great mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. With the streams of thy tears, thou didst cultivate the barrenness of the desert. And by thy sighings from the depths, thou didst bear fruit a hundredfold in labors. And thou becamest a luminary shining with miracles upon the world. O Sabbath, our righteous Father, intercede with Christ God that our souls be saved. Both now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Thou who for our sake was born of a virgin and did suffer crucifixion, O good one, and it's despoiled death through death, and as God did reveal resurrection, despise not those whom thou hast created with thine own hand. Show forth thy love for mankind, O merciful one. Accept the intercessions of thy mother, the Theotokos, for us. And save thy despairing people, O our Savior. Christ our God, the existing one, is blessed always, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. ages. Amen. Preserve, O God, the holy Orthodox faith and all Orthodox Christians. Unto ages of ages, amen. Most holy Theotoko, save us. the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim, thou without stain bearest God the word, and our truly Theotokos we magnify thee. Glory to thee, O Christ, our God and our hope. Glory to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Both now and ever, and unto ages of ages, Lord, have mercy, 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 the protection of the honorable bodiless powers of heaven, the supplication of the honorable glorious prophet Warner Baptist John, the holy glorious all audible apostles of our fathers among the saints, great hierarchs and ecumenical teachers of the holy glorious right victorious martyrs, especially the great martyr George, the trophy bearer, the patron and protector of the school of community, of the holy righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, of our venerable and God-bearing father, Savas the sanctified, the martyr Diogenes, the venerable Nectarios of Yangaris Kelly and Philotheos on Kareis on, Ath on Athos, Gurios, the missionary bishop of Kazan, and the venerable Nectarios of Gitol in Bulgaria, whose memory we celebrate today, and of all thy saints, have mercy upon us and save us for as much as he is good and loves mankind. Through the prayers of our holy fathers, Lord Jesus Christ our God, have mercy upon us and save us. Amen. God bless and keep all of you. We'll see you tomorrow morning at 9 and 10 a.m. Mountain, respectively, for Orthros and